What's up guys? Uh, welcome to another video. Right now we're actually gonna buy some stuff because we are at Harbor Freight. I am back, so let's get to the garage and so we can start working on the SI. So today what we're gonna do actually is we're gonna grind down the rear quarter panels because it is uh, hitting my wheel. So we're gonna use a angle grinder and then cut it and then we're gonna sand it down so that it's perfect. Uh, we're going to be using my smaller lens today because it's a little heavy carrying the other lens around but yeah hopefully this quality is okay with you guys. I'm still trying to push out great content. Um, today we're going to be working on the EK. It's been on hold for a long time. Um, the past two days actually or the past like week I've been working on the SI. So today what we're going to do is we're going to hopefully get more of the EK stuff done. I did buy new jacks actually from Harper Freight. Uh, I just needed two because my boy Kwa is coming here for uh, his transmission mount that we need to install um, because that's like the biggest thing that um, a lot of Genesis owners say that you should do because you get like second gear lockout for a transmission mount so I found that super weird but it is what it is for the Genesis um, so let's just get the uh, EK all ready so that we could work on it but look at this bro I must say my tuck game is really really strong god damn I'm like tucking like one fourth of the wheel but I already ruined the wheels because I'm trying to get like the best fitment possible and I don't know if you can see this but yeah so, uh, because of the tire profile that I have on it's not that big of a stretch so it's literally pushing out the rear bumper but it's okay because it just pops back into place when I air up but yeah look how <laughs> the whole wheels are destroyed <sighs> but oh well who cares that's what it is when it comes to cars you you build your brake you build it again and then you make it work, so. This car hasn't turned on in like three months. It's been like this for the last three months. Okay, first things first, what we need to do is fix the uh, upper camber arm because, uh, I don't know if you guys know La Tommy La, he told me that I installed it wrong, which is true. I need this part right here to be at the bottom because if I keep it up here, it'll hit my strut tower all the time so uh, let's take out this pin um, break this bolt loose and so we can put this underneath New day, but let's go get the fluids for the Civic so that we can get it running today, man. Cause like, uh, it's time. But well, first off, God damn, bro, you boy took it. All right, let's take the real whip out though. You know, not gonna lie, I've been really thinking about uh, trading in the SI for the newer SIs just because it has more amenities and it's like a newer vehicle. But you know, can't do that, bro. 8th gen all day, baby. Now that we have the manual transmission fluid, I went with genuine Honda because I don't want to mess anything up and uh, everybody recommended it. I did get 10W40 um, motor oil that you could use for the older Hondas, but I just went extra step and just got the um mtf from honda just so that uh we don't have to like redo it later if that makes sense so that's that we got one of the fluids checked out now we're gonna go to target actually because they have the um press tone coolant that i need i'm not gonna go to autozone because autozone be taxing on the coolant at uh target it's like eight dollars for a gallon at autozone it's like 17 but like come on bro you guys are a part store like you guys should not be upcharging that much and come on, compared to Target, bro, like Target is like a department store with everything there. So yeah, we're gonna go to Target because it's cheaper. And your boy, bro. 
Shit, okay. I see you, bro. Think you hot, bro? Damn. Still faster than my car, though. See, bro, this is what I'm talking about. Look, 10 bucks. We got ourselves 50 50 coolant. This is the green one, so, or greenish, yellowish that the older Hondas use. Let's get back to the house and get this EK running, man. Hey, dude. What? Can you, uh, are you gonna come, right? You're gonna come over? Uh huh. Uh, you wanna go, can you pick up some Jamba Juice? Can you pick up? Can you, can you pick up some some Jamba Juice? Uh, hey, can you, can you wake up? Thanks. I just finished eating. All right, so let's get the EK all <laughs> started because your boy ready to drive this car. Finally, it's about time, baby. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to Pimp My Ride. Uh, today. We're actually gonna get the EK running. Um, what we need to do is we're gonna do the oil. We're gonna top off the coolant because uh, it's pretty low right now. We're gonna put the reservoir back and then we're also gonna put transmission fluid because we need that transmission fluid to lube up the gears so that we can drive on out of here, you know? So, let's get started. Reservoir, as you can see, all that dirt and grime in there hasn't been changed ever since 2000, so 18 years full of dirt, hard uh, driving and sports oriented um, modifications. So we're gonna clean this out. Oh. All right guys, uh, so what we did here is we already put the um, the coolant overflow tank. It's already on there, uh, already filled with the coolant. Let's get the uh, tranny fluid in because I wanna finish that first before I do the oil because that's like the most annoying part. So yeah, let's start putting the tranny fluid on so that we can get it done. All right guys, so uh, under the car, we're gonna do the uh, drain bolt and then after that, the fill bolt's right there. We're gonna fill it with a uh, little tube. But first, we gotta get this drain bolt off so that we can drain all the fluid. Yeah, we drained it. We drained most of it, but we're gonna drain the rest of this fluid and then after that, we can put it back on and fill it up. All right guys, uh, we got, we're draining the oil now. You can see, we got the 5W30, we got the new uh, oil filter. So the EK is put back together, all the fluids are good. Um, basically everything is ready to go, I just need to put back the battery, charge it up and then we can turn on the car. I guess we're gonna let this charge up for like five minutes. After that, start up. Let's just start the thing up, bro, because I've, I've been waiting for this day, man. On, baby. Woo. Yeah, Josh, you always think you the shit. You think you hella raw. You're always touching boys and grabbing up on the balls. 
I don't even need the words to rhyme because I make it rhyme like halls. You got a slight cough sucking on dick here. Take some halls. Why you look like Rocky with your little cut up sweater? You need to learn how to diss better, <laughs> kiss better, and make me wetter. What's this? Nike and Adidas? I got a fucking platinum with no features. Why don't you go back to your shitty ass garage with all these rats fucking rolling around? You say you build humbly, but you're not even humble. Ooh! Just get back to working on your Honda Civic. Juicy just brought out. <laughs> You can see I have my backpack on, I'm gonna go home, back to Richmond. We did get the car running, but there was a problem. Um, whenever I'm driving, I was trying to like, try to bed the brakes. I just heard like a, on the left side, on the driver's side, I heard a clink, 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 clink when I was driving. So, that's gonna be on for another day. Just as long as this car's running, it's good with me. I already changed all the fluids. I'm about to go home now to Richmond. Your boy hella tired. I'm not even gonna go to the gym. So, yeah, make sure you guys subscribe, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you guys build humbly, and until next time, I'll catch you guys. Good you gang, good you gang, good you gang, good, good you gang. Spend 10 racks on you chain. My bitch loves to do cocaine. Ah! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Josh. Josh. What? Josh. Josh, 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 Josh. Did he do the face? Yes. Yes. Good you gang, good you gang, good you gang. Peace. <laughs>